This is a Bidrity Court sitting in honor of Supreme Court Justice Bode Roots Bebo, who bowed out of bench on Monday. In his Bidrity speech, he says corruption in Nigeria must be brought down through genuine efforts so as to make life more meaningful for the citizenry. He advocates that the country's electoral act be amended to shift the burden approved to INEC such that INEC will be the one to defend whether or not the election conducted is free, fair and credible. Customary law which disentitles a female child from partaking in her deceased father's estate is in breach of section 42 subsection 1 and 2 of the constitution. A fundamental rights provision guaranteed to every Nigerian. The said customary law is void as it conflicts with section 42 1 and 2 of the constitution. Female children are entitled to an inheritance. Governors in breach of election of elected local government tenures. It is the duty of the governors to ensure that the system of local government continues unhindered, dissolving local government councils and replacing them with caretaker committees amounts to the governor acting on his whims and fancies unknown to our laws, clearly illegal. It is the duty of the governor to ensure their existence rather than being responsible for destroying them. Also speaking at the court session, the Chief Justice of Nigeria, Mohamed Tanko, described retired Justice Bode Rhodes Bebo as a rare gem and unblemished jurist who has offered his best to the nation. We are here today to felicitate with an accomplished presidential high contract that has offered the best of his intellect to the advancement of the legal profession through the several years of inimitable adjudications. The issue raised by the retired justice on election where he blamed politicians that they are never satisfied with the outcome of results can be addressed through Electoral Act Amendment. Joseph Kadri, ITV News, Abuja.